Will I fix the characters later? No, I will not. Um, I, <laughs> I may fix the characters at the beginning of the next session if there's de new details on the forum post. However, right now I'm going to stop reading uh, welcome, the chat minion. and start actually playing. Dat Lobo! Thank you for the resub. I'm going to take a look at what I'm making here. I am making the training center. Is that the thing that's going to get me? No, it was Guerrilla Tactics, wasn't it? Guerrilla Tactics that give me squad size. But I need supplies. That's what I need. I need supplies for squad size. I'd say that is priority number one, right? That is priority number one. Alien debris, that's just going to give us maybe some supplies. Right, so... Am I just go? I'm going to go in here. Every time I go in here, something horrible happens. Am I making a... Okay, we've got a power relay. I can upgrade it. That's right. I'm going to build a workshop here to get free gremlins. Um, let's have a look. Advent data pad, one day. Training facility, four. Clear the debris. Supply drop. So, what have we got? We have got three out of three contacts. We can't make any more contacts. We don't have a lot of intel, and I really could do with some... Uh, triangulated position. We do have some missions that we wouldn't mind doing, but the big question is, do I not want to wait for... Oh, see, this one here, eight days. These are my A-team. These are my A-team. They're going to get us an engineer plus a promotion, and then we'll have a captain. But that means my A-team's out of commission at the moment. So... Oof. Those missions... Triangulated position and the encrypted signal. I don't know which one of those is... Um, hmm. Yeah. I don't know which one of, the, what, one of the, these I should do. East Asia? Oh, God, I really need to make more contacts as well, don't I? Because we have got several problems, like the Avatar Project and the Chosen to find. Gain intel in the HQ for the moment. Yeah, that's. I'm actually tempted to do that. You've got enough guys to do those missions. Really? So people were lying to me last time? People were telling me that I needed my A-team and probably needed upgraded armor for these missions. And now you're saying I can just take my B-team? And... I mean... You just need another gunslinger. Yeah, I don't have a gunslinger. You're saying all I need to do is, is get another gunslinger, but I, I don't... That's the, the, the problem is... It's not like I can just say, oh, well, all right, and, and then wander off to the uh, soldiers and say, I'll have another gunslinger, thanks. What I need to do is get one of my sharpshooters and train him down there. Let's have a look. Um, which one has he got? He's got long watch. He's a sniper, you see. So what I need to do then is take the other sharpshooter on a mission and get him some upgrades. Wait for your best team and full stuff. You see, that's the thing. Encrypted signal mission best effect. Right, I mean, the encrypted signal mission is going to be a tough one, isn't it? What about the triangulated position, then? Should I just do this one? Black market to get supplies from selling... Oh, right. Yeah, that's one thing. We could go to the black market, get some credits... Avenger plotting new When you get course. the training center, you can add gunslinger abilities to your sniper. You're treating the classes too rigidly. Market is I'm not open. treating the classes too rigidly. I don't have the training center, mate. That's the problem. I don't have it. So if we're going to go on the mission now, I, I, I don't have a gunslinger. Ignore the triangulated mission. It's terrifying. <laughs> okay. So, right. I can sell... 
probably corpses. I really don't want to sell too many of these, though, because I've got a feeling I'm going to need them. I don't like selling things at this stage. I don't need too many. Should I just sell the nanoscale vest? I'm never going to use it. Oh, some people are saying I need a six-man squad to do the DLC missions. Do not listen to the chat. See, this is what I'm thinking. Was that an attempt at reverse psychology? No idea what it is. Of course, the B team is fine. I want to see a lot of failure. Success is boring. Uh, nanoscale is not useful. Yeah, I mean, that's... I, I, I honestly... I, I, I'm never going to use it. All right, I'm, I'm going to sell that. Because I think now I have enough credits to buy my extra... thing. So... And for this one, we need a rank of captain plus 75 more supplies. This is the next one. I'm saving up 70. I want 75 supplies from one of these missions, and I will have a captain in eight days. Then I will have a six-man team. I will have a six-man team. Okay. Which means, then, the only other option at the moment is to make contact, and I don't have the intel or the contact space. What, what have we got here? Uh, alien facility can't do. That one can't do. Advent Black... Oh, can we do the Advent Black site now? We can do the Advent Black site now. We can. We can do the Advent Black site now. Is that a tough mission? That's probably a tough mission. But I can take five people. I can take some of the some of the rookies and things. Hmm. More soldiers, higher chance of casualties. I'd wait on the black site till you have your A team. So everyone, everyone, every one of these things needs an A team. God damn it! Well, then the other thing then is to go to the Reaper HQ and just get some intel. I want a six-man squad for the black site. Okay. Well, we do need intel. Because I'm low on intel, and I couldn't even count... I couldn't even reveal the last of those uh, dark pro problems. Okay, here we go. New targets. Okay, we've acquired new targets for our guerrilla operations against the Advent. Commander, the aliens can... This is the problem. ...on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow okay. them down, we'll need to move fast. Just to clarify, do those missions need a six-man team, or does Gopher need a six-man team? Be nice. All right, we'll get you killed. Are you a soldier? We'll get you killed. I am. Um, all right. So, the West Asia one gives is moderately difficult, but it does give 153 supplies, and it counters the scanning, the signal jamming, dark event. Now that this event sounds bad, but. It's not terminal, right? Oh, is it? Is that the worst? That is far and away the worst one. So this is this is the one I should counter anyway, right? Okay. So this one, I'm supposed to... You want me to counter this one? Leaving only large amounts of lost. And it's a lost mission. It's a lost mission. It's a lost mission. But lots and lots and lots of them. But it will give me 153 supplies, which means uh, six-man team for the next missions. And it counters what is apparently a bad one. Let's just look at the other ones, though. New Arctic, Operation Purple Crone. Destroy the alien relay. Huh, the, here's the problem. We don't know what this one is. It does give a scientist, and that would be nice. Scientists could be nice. However, we're going to get a lot of psionic enemies. Difficulty, difficult. Lots of psionic enemies, but it counters the hidden event. Whatever that is. Don't know what that is. Uh, East Asia. Moderate difficulty. We get a ranger. Yeah, don't want soldiers, gotta be honest with you. Do you have enough intel to reveal the hidden event now? Nope. 
Uh, black site is doable, not easy, but doable. We're, we're way off a of black site at the moment. Forget the black site. I don't know what the DLC missions are. No, right. Take it slow and rush through. Thanks for that. I'd say do the lost mission. You'll need supplies more than scientists. This one counters the counterattack. Units have a chance to enter Overwatch after being revealed. That doesn't sound too bad, that. That does not sound like the worst one. Plus, I don't want a ranger at the moment. I mean, I'm not saying I don't want soldiers, and a sergeant could be useful. But... This one... This one we we know is a bad one, and we know the reward is something we really want, right? And it's lost. Okay, let's do this one then. Confirmed. We're going to West Asia. Setting course for Sector 15, West Asia. Now, this is lost. I don't Commander, have... You should be aware. We're detecting lost activity in this area. Right. Our forces will need to be especially vigilant. So, against Lost, let's... Now, I don't want these guys to be too injured either. Because uh, these guys are probably A-team, right? These guys are probably A-team. Let's, let's just remove everyone for now. Make weapons available and make utility weapon, uh, items available. Right. We've already agreed that against Lost, the Templar is going to be absolutely awesome, right? That's going to be absolutely awesome. As soon as the Lost get close, it's just stabby, stabby, stab, stab. Yep. Automatic. As soon as the Lost get in range, just be stab in the face, stab in the face, stab in the face. Who would be next? Reaper. I don't think Reaper is... Well, I suppose it could be good against Lost. Mox, yes. Silverdawn says it. Mox is good in Lost Missions. Uh, we took him on one last time, and I do remember he was pretty damned good. What does he have? He has Marauder. Standard shots are not turn ending, allowing for shooting, then moving, shooting twice on a turn. Grapple. Oh, right, we can do the grapple strike. Tactical rigging provides an additional utility slot. Providing the armor does not already have one. Right, right. So, yeah, okay. So, Mock's probably a good idea. Shall, shall I give Shall I give the Templar the dodge personal combat sim? I sort of think I should. Okay. So there we go. We've got a We've got a dodge. A dodge. Templar, I need to sort the loadout. Plated Templar armor, shard gunners. I don't think I can change any of this, can I? Right, it's lost. We do not want. We do not want grenades, right? Give give you a med kit. Probably want a. Um, probably do want an actual medic. I wouldn't go with a sniper for this. Well. They have pistols. Isn't pistols always good? So, mocks. Weapon up. Well, first of all, let's do the loadout, right? Plated skirmisher armor. Bullpup. Cal 7? No, we want, he wants the Cal 50. That's the best one, right? That is the best one, right? And rip jack. Frag grenade. Don't want a frag grenade. But to be honest with you, it's not even like he's got a huge number of options. So, if we're saving, if we're saving something for a, one of the medics, uh, what do we do? We even have a medic. Naga is what is Naga? Naga is. Oh right, Naga is a medic. Naga is a medic. I believe. So, let's... Oh, still grenade. Uh, okay, so, magnetic rifle. Right, we don't want the bolt caster. We definitely don't want the bolt caster. No, we don't. I'd say no medic, only firepower. Eh, it's always nice to have a medic who could revive someone just in case. 
Um, Nagra is a hacker? Oh, oh god, a I saw the word aid. I saw the word aid and thought first aid. Don't know why. Do not know why. Um, specialist. Eugene, was it Eugene was a medic? Aid protocol. Hack. Okay. That's two hackers. And... Specialist jean -Cli. Aid. Three hackers! Um... Jaquita Seal? For the... Oh, no! Medical protocol! That's the one I'm looking for, isn't it? No, that's... The, I'm just... I'm... I'm still looking... I am still looking for, for first aid for some odd reason. Got it in my head. All right, no. There you go. We got a medic. We got a medic. Uh, loadout. Uh, make utility items available. Okay, so we got a medic... Magnetic rifle. All right. So. Frost grenade. We lost a frost grenade. We lost it. We don't have it. Bring me for the ladders. Ha 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 ha. Right. I I'm thinking we're taking a rookie as well, right? But. Do we have a sharpshooter in... Right. Shea Sinclair. Should we take... I mean, let's just take the sharpshooter, right? Okay, we can't... I mean, this is... We've got so few items. We don't have the credits to make any. This is why we need credits. Gauss rifle. All right, let's take the best Gauss rifle we've got. Mag pistol. Still better than all of these, I think. All right. We'll take him. We definitely want a sharp uh, gunslinger in training. We need... Bits are not showing. Are the bits not showing? Really? Oh, no, I changed the bits. I do, oh, right. Uh, give me a second. I've changed the bits. To own... Right. To, to, yeah, okay. 50. Oh, right. Sorry. I've, I've put a, I put a limit on it to stop the one bit spam. And I can't remember what I put it on, to be honest. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah, no, I sorry, I'll have to check that out. I was um I changed the limit a few days ago because of the uh the spam we were getting. <laughs> okay, anyway, so right, yeah, I'll sort that out, I'll figure it out. I haven't quite have to give fifty thousand I don't remember what I sent. I think I said it's a hundred. I think I said it's a hundred. That's not is that a lot that's 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 a dollar, isn't it? Probably a hundred. It's probably that. It's something like that. It's something like that. I just, I, I, I want to discourage the one bit spam that was going on constantly because it was a little distracting. And, and right now, I kind of want to focus and not get anyone else killed. I'm not taking my A team, but it, they're A team ish. Mox and my Templar are definitely A team, so I don't want to get them killed. So what do you think then? Is it time to take a rookie? Is it time to take J Bites or Larry? Does this work? Yeah, that worked. Jaquita Seal. Okay. Reaper could come in handy. Another sharpshooter. Um, well, that's, a, that's actually a good point. Train the sharpshooters up to get gunslingers. Because how many sharpshooters I've got? I've got, now, of all frogs, is a sniper. And I've only other got two of the sharpshooters. I would not take a rookie. Something better than a rookie. All right. Um... How could you possibly get distracted by bits? Dude, because it's all over the place. I'm, I'm having to... Right now, I am looking at three screens trying to focus on things. It's not like you're going to miss a shot because of them. It's not that. It's like I'm going to miss 
uh, what's going on? I'm not going to spot something or I lose my train of thought. And that is, that is going to be deadly. So, um, anyway, what was it? So not, then in which case, I just take another, and uh, take another sharpshooter. And either one of these can become a sniper, one can become a gunslinger. Here's the thing. Is it me or does Sinclair look like he should be a sniper? And Crowfoot looks like she should be... Who's, who's that? What's the first name on that one? Kali Rohe. She looks like she should be a gunslinger to me. I suppose we could have two gunslingers, but he just looks too sniperish to me. Of all frogs into sniper yet. Uh, yeah, he's taken the sniper path of all frogs. He's got that first one. That return fire is useful. Look over here, a distraction. Yeah. <laughs> so, rookie can be trained in the new building. Eventually, once I get the building, yes. Okay. Should we do that then? Two two people with pistols, because that's the thing here. They've both got pistols. Do I have a better Gauss rifle for you? No. They've both got pistols. Weapon upgrade. Available slot. Superior scope. Might as well put a superior scope on that. Superior expanded magazine. Oh! This increases the clip size by three. That is actually... Isn't that something we want on a sniper rifle anyway? Isn't that... Oh, I can't remove these from... I can't remove them, can I? So once I use this, if I use this on this weapon, I'll never be able to get it off. Hmm. Give it to Mox for a kill zone sniper. Yeah, but I mean, how long will it be before we have a kill zone sniper? People are saying give that to Mox. Save at least one superior extended mag for your Reaper. It will come in handy later. So I can't remove them, can I? I can't get them back. Once I've used them, I've used them. Expect Gopher to notice subs, tips, and tips. Has anyone seen any of his videos? Probably most people here, I think. I think most people are probably regular viewers, mate. Uh, Mox needs expanded magazines. Does he? All right. So, mind you, mind you, the, the, these rifles get upgraded automatically, don't they? So they keep their... Uh, they actually keep their upgrades. So if I put on a sniper rifle, I'll still have it towards the end. All right, so I'll still have them towards the end. But we're saying Mox's weapon could be... This could be good, because he... Superior Extended Expanded Magazine, because he's got a very low... All right, okay. As long as these weapons get upgraded and keep their upgrades, we don't really matter. You can remove them, yes, but you have a special... I don't... Actually, removing them isn't actually what I need. As long as the weapons that where we get upgraded actually keep the um, the mods, and they do. Snipers, Reapers, Skirmishers, and Grenadiers need expanded mags. Yeah, okay. Can shoot twice, so extended mag is good for him. Now, I think you're right. I think you're right. I'm going to put this on him. Because, of course, for this next few missions, probably, my snipers are going to be using the pistol anyway. So, there you go. Six shots. We got it. I think we've got everyone. I can't even fill these slots. That's how desperate I am for stuff. Oh, my God. He can also use a scope. Oh, all right. But I've put the scopes on the sniper rifles for now because we kind of need them. Remove nades. Does, oh, do I... Get, wait, 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 wait. Do I get more movement if I remove things? If, if I remove the grenades, do I get more movement? Mobility, like, 12. I can't actually remove them. It won't let me. It, it won't actually let me remove them. <laughs> 
But out of curiosity, if I... I mean, if I, if I remove this... Mobility 30. No, it doesn't, doesn't give me any more mobility. Only in Long Watch 2 does that happen. Yeah, okay. I remember something like that. Okay, but then in which case, guys, this is it. This is the team. We're going. We've taken... We've been careful. We've prepared. We've got two gunslinger ishy people. We got a Templar. We got a Skirmisher. And we got a Medic. We're going. We're going. Ranger deployed. Menace ready to deploy. Okay, here we go. It's better to carry nades and not need them to, than to need them and not carry them. Yeah, it's true, but I can't actually take Dr. any extra Kigen nades. Has been looking for new methods all of right, intercepting the alien's data on their latest operation. Neutralize all like targets. Of an oh no, we no, no, no. no, it's one of those missions. Fortunately, Advent is already in position attempting to freeze the connection. Move in and neutralize. Oh, we gotta move quickly. Secure the area and recover that data. We have to stop their progress before it's too late. Okay. Menace one five. This is Avenger. The access point we're after is just ahead. Move to secure the area. Expect hostile resistance. Okay then. So we're, we're 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 in stealth, and we gotta get there. Okay then. So who should I send forward first? Probably probably Mox, right? I mean, Mox has got that whole. I can move very very. Right, we're up, we've got nine rounds. Take your time, but do it quickly. Thank you. Out of curiosity, where can he grapple to? There for now. Okay, so I, I wasn't... I'm not going to grapple. I'm just... So, I'm thinking Mox first. We move Mox forward. Hmm. Run, but don't rush. Yeah. Good advice. Okay. Moving him a blue. Hmm. We got one ladder, two ladders. Here's the thing. I don't really want to be blocking ladders until I've... Oh, I kind of do, but I want to get in there and hack that thing. You need to dash once and blue on each... T yeah, probably going to dash first round, to be honest. Here we go. Look at all those ladders. We, the thing is, is we can't hole up and just fight the lost. That's the... Oh. That breaks it. Oh, I don't like this at all. I'm not going to send anyone far ahead. What I'm thinking of doing is moving Mox over here with his grapple. So he's still got a shot. Oh, he can't do that yet. He can't do that yet. He can't go forward. This doesn't break stealth, but I'm worried it's going to activate something down here. But I'm not sure I can afford to go too slowly. I kind of want to move everyone onto this roof. Oh yeah, Mox could grapple away. That is, that is true, hopefully. I'm just trying to find out where right now. Templar, Templar can move quite a lot. Oh, the biggest problem with that move is he goes down. Could expose himself there. See, what I'd like to do is get here so I could see down here for when Mox runs across. But that isn't actually an option. So, actually, Mox running across seems to be the best. Use waypoints. How do I use the waypoints again? Which one was it? Was it control? 
thing is, I don't think she can get there with he can get there without dropping down. To be honest, uh, I must remind myself I use the advanced options to double timers. Okay, you can press control. Yeah, I mean, but like I said, it's it's there's no way to get there in a single run. You see. So if I go there, we expose ourselves to the underneath. So in actual fact, I actually think just it's best if I do it with mocks, and then if we do activate anything, we can at least uh, maybe grapple away with mocks, grapple back, or cover him somehow. I don't, I don't honestly know how we're going to do that. Um, mocks could stay there on the ladder and block it. Where else could the lost climb up? There is Advent as well. Oh, I know, I know, I know. All right, I'm going to move Mox here. And if something activates here, well, we just have to deal with it. Can't grapple with no moves. No, 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 that's also true, actually. See, I could go there and then nothing can climb up. Nothing can climb up there. And since Mox is moving quite far ahead of everyone, that might be the sensible thing to do. Are there any other climbing points? It doesn't look like there's any other climbing point. So if Mox activates Lost there, he should be fine. If he activates Advent, he could be in trouble. No Advent on the Horde missions. Is there no Advent whatsoever on the Horde missions? Ever. Okay, then. In which case, then, blocking the ladder is probably the sensible thing to do. That way, at least he cannot get swamped. I will move. Okay, was that? That's lost. There's the lost. All right. I say we we we. We're gonna have to try and kill them because we're never gonna get past. Right. Oh. Damn it, because I've blocked... Here's the thing! I've blocked... I've blocked the path so I can't get up now. Uh, yeah, okay. Smart, but not smart. I'm thinking of moving the Templar there. We're going to get the Templar pretty close, right? I mean, we, here's the thing. Here is the thing. We gotta fight them. We gotta kill them. We have gotta kill them. So blocking is done by the last man. Yeah. To be honest with you, what I was worried was he was gonna run down them. That's gonna be lost here, and they were all gonna run at him. So I was blocking. But yeah, you're right. Actually, I should probably have moved him in and took the risk, and then hope, and then come and blocked it with the Templar. That's what I should have done. Oh, well. All right. Now the Templar is the Templar is uh, the safest of all of them, right? Because if any of the lost move towards her, she'll just stab them. I'll lead the way. Him, him, him. We lost the female Templar. Okay, but we're, so we're we're just going to use this this time to get a bunch of moves in. We don't need to worry too much about cover, but you know what? good habit anyway, right? We're going to move them in as far as we can. We've got to take these guys out. We're not blocking tons and tons of ladders anyway. I'm all over it. We've got to, we've got to move pretty damn quickly, so the whole ladder blocking plan from last time isn't going to work this time. Oof. Now, I, I am thinking at the moment, just distance. That's what I'm thinking, distance. Although I am worried that that thought is stupid. But I'm thinking distance. The other one can get... Oh, we can get in there. I 
like to keep them. I like to keep them together. I really do. All right, I'm going to do this. I'm going to. I'm going to sprint this one here. The lost don't move much, do they? They don't patrol. Let's do this. And then I'm going to move you to here. I want to keep them all close together for now. Sniper on Overwatch. No, we actually don't want to Overwatch anyone. We really don't. We want to get them as close as possible. Go, go. We want to, we want to get as much movement as possible this round. Dashes move fast, right? We're not too far from this thing. But we're going to be in combat for the rest of it. So, let's have a look where Mox can get. Mox, right, he's... Curiosity. He could, he could activate them there, couldn't he? He can get there in a single grapple and then start shooting, right? Just avoid them. Uh, don't they start moving towards you as soon as you activate? Because I know I can kind of go down there and then come up. But as soon as I do that, isn't that a turret as well? Aren't I going to have to destroy the turret? Mox can go to the little advent thing by the bridge. What bridge? This bridge. Do you, you mean this? I mean, it's... it's. I mean, that's it. Mox can get here and start shooting them. I'm worried about this, though. What is that? Because that looks distinctly turret. Why not throw the Templar in there and have him parry the turret? I'm, I'm assuming that is hilariously uh, funny sarcasm, right? Engage with the melee Templar. He will murder them with... All right, that's a camera. That is a camera, is it? All right. Okay. So I got two choices. I either... I can grapple Mox here to start shooting with them, or... Or... As someone else said, I can actually move my Templar. I can, I can literally just... Where is Bolt? Bolt is psionic attack. Where's the, where's the slash? Fire pistol? Re is it rend? Melee attack. It is. It's rend, right? It's rend. I can just... Rend on one of them, and then the rest will come running. And she'll just hit them all, right? A camera that shoots bullets. I mean, the thing is, I sort of feel like that's a dangerous plan. Because then she's there all by herself. Aren't they going to start, like... I suppose, I suppose she gets a rend, but then they all can move into place and start hitting. You shouldn't trust the chat. Yeah, I wouldn't. Mox can grapple. I know, Mox can grapple there and then can start shooting them, right? After a kill, you can move the Templar. True. You might activate more loss that are far away. Possible, But, like I said, I think I can move Mox here and then I can move all the others into place. As long as I get one kill, I can move the Templar away, can I not? If I activate more Lush, I can move the Templar away. Parry only works once per turn, so we don't want to rely on parry. I want to get... Here's... But here's what I do want to do. When I'm attacking one of these guys with the whatever it's called, Rend, I don't want to end up stood next to a bunch of them like there attacking one of them because I need all of them to move so like what I'd like to do that that for example that would work that would no would that work how, 
how do I actually change? Okay, so like I could rend from there, attacking that that one, right? Like that. Then all the rest have to move into position. Blade Storm is every attacker in melee range. But don't they have to move with Blade Storm? With Blade Storm. Free shard attacks on any enemies that enter or attack from melee range. Oh right, so So in actual fact, do you think do you do you think foolproof plan what could So what you're saying are you saying that even if they attack her, even if she's in melee range, just before they attack, she gets an attack first? I just want to clarify that. So, like, even if I stood right next to them, killed one, and then stayed there, the one that didn't have to move, I'd still get an attack on him when he tried to melee me. Yes. All right. Okay. Well, that's good. Although, I still don't see any point in not making them move anyway. Then I'm going. It's a he. I know it's a he. I'll get used to it probably when we get our first female Templar. All right. I'm going to do that. I'm going to rend this one, activate those four. If there are any others, I'm going to move the Templar out. And then we're going to move Mox in. Oh my god. This world is ours. Darkness is lifted. Boom! <laughs> oh, okay. Did it? More loss. More lost. Thing is, that's not a problem though, right? Unless we get any with more health. Focus rend damage. Oh my god. Love the Templar. Okay. Can I just run the Templar forward? <laughs> and let them all come? Can I just do that? Can I just... I mean... We got one... Is that a lost left but without health? Or is that just a dead body that hasn't fallen over yet? I can't tell. I mean, they've all got, from what I can see, they've all got little health. My biggest worry is, oh no, one of them's got five. One of them's got five. As long as they're under five, no, they're not. One of them's four. Leave him there where the others can back him up. All right, I've got, I've got eight rounds I don't have to rush, right? I don't have to rush. So what I should do then is get all my other guys up high. I should get Mox to here. Oh, her first, the first rend increased damage five to six. Another rend will make it six to seven. Okay, just parry. They'll all come to her like a mimic. She can parry the fifth, the five health one. But that's the thing. Does she, he, does he even need to parry at this point? Mind you, no, don't. All I was thinking was, oh, I can, I can move him forward and get some distance. But I've got eight rounds to get there. So what I should actually do is stay in sight of everyone, right? I should stay in sight with everyone and just move everyone into a better position. So I'm thinking I move Mox to there. I grapple Mox to there. Oh, actually, to be honest with you, I could just... Can they even get on this side? Can they even get on this side? I mean, if Mox went there, could they actually attack him? Could he get back down? Okay, set overwatch. I'll set overwatch, but honestly, I almost feel like I'm using... Gra grapple Mox and shoot the five health one. That's the other option. All right, let's... Oh, that's not... All right, we're going to grapple Mox here. He's now blocking that ladder, so he should be safe from them. But he can also 
justice. What's this? Use the grapple to pull a humanoid target and deliver a rip. I kind of want to do that. Wrath, use the grapple to pull yourself to an enemy and... Di oh, no, I don't want to do that. Don't want to do that. Justice pulls them to me. Justice pulls them to me. Should I do that? Use the grapple to pull a humanoid target to you and deliver... Okay. I could pull... Oh, no, that's a bad idea because that one wouldn't kill it. <laughs> bad idea. Justice. I could shoot after justice. All right, so... That, that one, that's a four. But you can shoot it. I can, but this is a 100%. This is like a one... Oh, should I save that just for, for an... You know what? I should save that for an oh my god moment, shouldn't I? I should just shoot them. I should just shoot them. Save that for an emergency. I probably don't even need to shoot them. Really. I don't. Just shoot as many as possible with mocks. It's one thing to shoot a... Uh, Jam them with a claw. I know, but they're, 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 let's face it, they're only zombies anyway. I am the victim. I mean, he's got so much ammo now. Okay. Their service is over. You need to train the snipers to get gunslingers. I do, but the actual experience from each individual shot on these guys is so minimal that it's just nothing compared to the experience you get for actually finishing the mission. Isn't that right? Or am I getting that wrong? We triumph. Okay, and reload. Oh my god, no, and he can still keep shooting. <laughs> we deny our creators. Templar carry much. I are, are you paying any attention? I mean the the Templar killed four. Mox is just free. But it's got no more targets. Uh okay, just reload again. Reloading. It's as best to farm as many lost with the sharpshooters as possible. Is it? Uh, okay. Um. Confirmed. Have we got a shot at anyone? No, nope, we don't. Um. Lost in a nutshell. Right, so... To be honest with you, that, that is dead, right? That is dead. Please tell me that's dead. I'm thinking of moving the Templar forward just to have something, just so that they focus on him. Ignore chat, Gopher. Not me, though. Okay, right. So, all right. Look, here's the thing, right? Let's let's move, let's move those guys in closer then. Position confirmed. And if we get more lost, we'll tr we'll try to use we'll try to use the um I'm all the gunslingers. Get them some experience. Although at the moment. Keep the squad intact. Yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to leave the Templar there, so if anything tries to sneak past and get them, he'll hack the living. Should I parry? If I got a cooldown on the parry, should I just skip turn, or is it best to parry every turn? Is it always one of those things? Parry just... Parry's always something you can do. Parry's something you can always do, yes. 
I'm assuming that was a yes for that. All right, I'm just going to parry. If you're not going to move, why not parry? All right, there you go then. Bunch more locks. What? Oh. Stand proud. Or. Okay. 